Hello and welcome everybody to my lecture about understanding the electric grid, the requirements, structure and what is essential for grid stability. So your benefit of the course is basing understanding of the principle of the electrical grid, understanding of the task and how they are solved and an explanation of typical solutions as state of the art. So in this course I do not do detailed plant engineering for example. So, the resilient electrical system relies on two aspects. Aspect number one is energy as a global quantity and the second one is power as a global quantity. And for the sake of completeness of overview, I show you the complete content of this course. Today, we concentrate on redispatch. This is production side power balancing. Now, let's get started. So here you can see a network which consists of two zones. Zone number one is on the left side and has three generating units, for example. Zone number two is on the right side and has two generating units. And this means there's a surplus of power in zone one, a deficit of power in zone two, and there is a power flow from zone one into zone two. And this keeps the system stable. Now let's assume that after a certain time, these Situation has turned around, there is a surplus in zone 2, a deficit in zone 1 and the power flow goes the other way. But what will happen if there is a limitation in the transfer of power? We call this a bottleneck. So there is too little transport capacity for power for current and this would mean that we have a deficit on zone 2 which after a certain time might develop into a crisis unless harsh measures are taken like load shedding which nobody wants. So there is only one solution to keep the law of conservation of energy and the balance of power now at an equilibrium. That means we must start a third generation of infeed in zone number two. And now we have a balance of energy. Each zone is on equilibrium. So this is carried out by a subordinate authority. So this was today's short lecture about exchange of power in a network and redispatch. I thank you very much and please stay tuned to my channel.